What's up, Goo Squad? It's your boy Jody Magic Fest Keith here today with some Magic Fest testing. That's right, we got Magic Fest Niagara coming up in a couple weeks, so we need to get on that legacy grind. This deck was submitted by one of my oldest goons, Dark PK, uh, looking to possibly play this at the Grand Prix this weekend. I mean, next weekend. So we want to definitely play, you know, some version of the deck. Uh, this is the latest list by Grizzle Puff. Also known as Bob Wong. Make sure you check out his content on Channel Fireball. The top four this past weekend in the Legacy Challenge with this list. First initial thing uh, I want to do is cover how this deck works for those new to the deck. I always like to welcome in new Legacy viewers. And uh, the way this deck work, it works, it's called Slow Depths. It's a Dark Depths deck. Dark Depths is a land that comes into play with 10 counters on it. When it has no counters on it, sacrifice it. If you do, you get a 2020 Flying Black Avatar creature token with Indestructible. So, how do we get the counters off the Dark Depths? Well, there's two ways. You have Vampire Hex Mage, which is a creature you can sacrifice to remove all counters from a permanent. And you have Thesbian Stage, which is a land that lets you copy another land. Now, when you copy the Dark Depths, you have two legendary permanents with the same name. So, you have to sacrifice one of them. So, you sack the original Dark Depths. Now, you have a... Dark Depths with no counters on it, which would then trigger the Dark Depths, sacrifice it, make the 2020. Uh, and everything is going towards that end. Hex Mage stage pairing with the Dark Depths. You have seven scryings and crop rotations to help dig up the Dark Depths or the Thespian stage, whatever you're missing, along with a couple one of lands that are nice. We have Wasteland if we want to attack our opponent's mana base. Urborg is great because it allows our Dark Depths, which otherwise wouldn't be able to tap for mana actually tap for mana um all in all everything's working towards making this 2020 and that's the biggest plan we backed it up with this card and ways to find it with a little interaction in the slow version uh via like abrupt decay so <coughs> if you enjoy this content make sure you like comment share subscribe hit the thumbs up button to help people find it hit the notification bell to be alerted when new videos go up and if you enjoy the content and want to see more of it you can support this content best through one-time paypal donations joining my patreon for the sweet perks or getting you some goon squad gear to represent your next event so let's go ahead and jump right into a league what's up evil mailman thanks for that switch prime love baby happy anniversary boo how you living <laughs> uh music is a tad louder than me you know what? i turned all the music down when i was doing the intro let me turn it down a little bit is that is that more better is some songs are louder than others. So let's go ahead and jump into the Constructed Leagues Legacy League. I've missed you, baby. I'm home. I'm home. We back again, goons. We back. Oh, man. Missed your Legacy League. <laughs> Did you miss me? Daddy's home. What's up? <laughs> the goon father returned. <laughs> We're here. Let's get in a match here. Oh, man. Look at Big Ward, 28. <laughs> 10 trophies, look at him. Big Ward. Matt Soul, we knew who Matt Soul is. E.W. Landon. E.W. Landon's a streamer. <laughs> Plays a lot of Legacy. Same people. Lewis, CBR. People still out here. They're still doing it. I went somewhere else, but they're still doing it. Flying Whales has been killing it. Return of the Mac, man. Cue it up. Cue it up, the evil man, man, come on. <laughs> you know, return to the back. When I got out the Uber in Cleveland from the airport, when I got in the Uber in Cleveland, which is kind of trippy, uh, they didn't have, like, a special section at the airport for the Ubers. Uh, they, every Uber I took was playing that R&B station out there, and it was all return to the Mac and shit. I was like, nice. I was like, y'all got it. We're on the play. This is a one-lander, whether we play the Mox or not. It's not exciting. Do have a thought sees. But uh we really need a second land a seven scrying for a dark depths and then we can hex mage. I don't know, I think I'm a mulligan in this hand. I I'll, I'll keep this one. Uh, that hand is probably keepable. Like I would have kept that hand on the draw. You know, the one lander. Because we have the Mox Diamond, so it's got some explosive opportunities. If we draw any one of our 26 lands left in the deck, it's almost it's a little more than 50% after opening a 7-card hand. Then, uh, is that right? 26, 
53 cards. Yeah, it's about 50%. Uh, no herb work. Interesting. Um, I'm going to put this on the bottom. Since we already have a stage to go to the dark depths, so we just hope that it's fast enough. Seven safekeeper protect. Watching this on YouTube, got live music on the. It's like a reanimator. Oh, we're so dead. Cabal therapy himself. All right, Buddha Master. I'm just going to concede for the sake of time. Alright, so what do we want against the reanimator deck? Maybe not him. I don't know. It is a combo deck, so you kind of want him. Definitely want these surgicals and this Caracas. These needles for that Grizzle brand. I don't think we need Safekeeper. We don't need this Dried Armor. I'm not a big fan of Abrupt Decay either. Maybe Trophy. Maybe, maybe we do want these hymns. Some lands we don't need. Nope. Want them all. You got a whole extra land. There's probably a land that we can cut to keep our men about the same. I don't think we need the loam. Maybe go less on combo, more on control, cut the Sylvans. Just keep prop rotation. Yeah, I like this. How do I see how many doubloons I have for a donation list? Crayson, you can go to, uh, let's see. Should be in the Twitch TV. If you go to, if you look on the app. On the, on the screen right now if you're on a computer. Are you on a computer? Uh, if you're on a computer, there's going to be a little overlay. That's not there right now. So let me turn that on because whenever I stream Arena, I use a different uh, extension that, that overlaps the, the, the doubloon one. Which is kind of unfortunate that they overlap my extensions. Let's put the, the stream lab ones on. Activate. Gotta replace the MTG Arena one. Alright, so you'll see the little logo in the bottom right. Just go ahead and click on that. It'll tell you how many you have. But Grayson, wait Grayson, let's see. You're a tier one sub, so you can, you can submit a deck list. Like, uh, and then, uh, aren't you on my Patreon? Oh, uh, you're on phone? Well, I think there's like a link to get to the extensions. I don't know if you're on my Patreon, but you know, that's a lot of things. What's up, Dark BK? Man, you gotta do it like this, Dark BK. I'm gonna teach you how to emote, bro. <laughs> Got a double discard here. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try. Uh, I hope it's good enough. I, I doubt it's gonna be, but we'll see. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There you go, he did it, Dark PK. Uh, I'm take the discard outlet and hope they don't draw another one this turn, and then we'll go for the reanimation spell on the second turn. Nice. I changed the list that you submitted because it was a while ago. I'm just playing Grizzle Buffs list from this past weekend. Woo 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 
Yeah, you, you did. So I just grabbed a more current list. Same thing that I did uh, with Doctor Prison that I played last week, which I, I should have up on YouTube. Y'all make sure y'all check that out. I've been working on my uh, thumbnail game. Love to hear some feedback about that. Going from knowing nothing about graphic design to uh, figuring some stuffs out. It's not currently a consideration. Well, what are you considering for Niagara? Love to hear. You know, flashback this looting. Whiff, baby, whiff. He needs to draw a reanimation spell. Has a Chancellor already. The Chancellor's really not that scary. Because we've got a 2020 coming in two turns. <laughs> oh, Dark BK, leave it all up to me, huh? Alright. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out together. But we're, we're, this is off the table right here, right? That's what you're saying. I ain't got a crop rotation, buddy. Got the rest, though. Tomb Assassin's Trophy. Oh boy. They don't have black mana, green mana. Let's take the Entomb. Let's get another Bayou. And play a Civil Library. Nice. They can't cast that Assassin's Trophy right now. And if they don't this turn, they don't play green mana this turn, then we'll just make the 2020 on our own turn. I hit my kids and my wife, and now uh, I cannot find them. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> Good for you, buddy. All right, I definitely want to use this. Uh, uh, I think I messed this up. Start with a thought sees. And then the, they trophy the stage. Then we'll go get a swamp, go hex mage depths. Float mana just for posterity. Here we go. Give me the swamp. Ah, I whipped on my thought sees. Got no hand right now. Nice, nice. Yeah, you, you gotta write down like and and hit and you gotta hide, like write yourself a note somewhere and hide it next time, Matt Collins. That way you know how to retrieve your uh, wife and kids when the goon squad show is over. It's the best advice I could give you. That's how I handle such matters. <laughs> Too bad. No regrets. I don't want to see the day. <laughs> nice. Man, it's freezing in my house, man. Tom did a poll. How cold is it supposed to be? I don't think he listened to what nobody said. Because <laughs> I'm going to put an Arctic in here. Got the hoodie on. I'm out here freezing, y'all. We got no lands. Three M's, though. Hmm. So what did I do this weekend? Well, seriously, I was thinking the elf deck I submitted two weeks ago. Okay. Ain't worried about no chalice, huh? Alright, let's just go with all this card and hope it works out. Dress him now. Oh, you got Chancellor, huh? I didn't see that. Damn you, Moto! I mean, I still would have cast it, but damn you, Moto. I probably wouldn't have cast it. But 
Like they like on Arena, they had a little stuff pop up on the left when when there's like a static ability that needs to be uh, made aware. Not the case this time. Show and tell. All right. Tide spot. Alright. Looks like we're dead. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, Creason. I are you on the uh Oh yeah yeah. Are you on the uh thanks for putting that link in there, Dark UK. Are you on my Patreon? I think you're on my Patreon, right? You get you get five just for uh being a sub. If you're a higher tier sub, you get basically however much you pay in doubloons. Okay, yeah. Alright, so like if you're a $25 sub, you get 25 doubloons with one list every month. Is, is, is how I rock it. Same thing with the Patreon. This is so annoying. You can't beat this. I guess we could have drawn a, Car a Caracas. A Caracas would have been alright. Or, actually, maybe that was a preemptive scoop. I just hate playing against your animator. It's funny because you play against it so much online, but I'll go to paper tournaments, play 13 rounds of Legacy, and never play against your animator. Not one time. Or, at most, one time. No, Dark PK, because if we drew a Caracas, we could have Caracas at Grizzle Brand. And they had six cards at four life, so. They wouldn't be able to gain any life to be able to activate the Grizzle Brand again. And without a bunch of cards, we still got time to fight that thing, but obviously it would have been hard. Oh, I'll keep this. Chancellor Annex again? My goodness. Mox Diamond is the perfect ch uh, Chancellor Checker. Is rough your opponent looks at you like you're a monster every game. <laughs> well, it would be that that look would be deserving, I would say. <laughs> Probably should have fetched. Fetch the bayou. Still pitch the forest, but you know. But you got Chancellor Annex, man. Oh man, oh man, oh boy, oh boy. Oh lordy. What you coming with, Shouty? Please just be a little Chancellor. A little baby Chancellor. Badlands, that's wastelandable. Thought sees, huh? Yeah, we should have fetched. Just let me draw another one, that'd be great. We're definitely gonna wasteland now if we don't have action. It's all when some big kid on Infect gives you the old guess you didn't want to play Magic today, eh? <laughs> I played Living in Grayson. I, uh, I did not have the mind frame to play the stacks, man. I've been out the loop for a little while. Saw so Audible. Selfish Audible that, that didn't pay off at all. I played it last week in a league on the stream, which is on YouTube now. If y'all are new here, make sure you check out the YouTube. Uh... And it, I went 4-1 with it in that league, and the only loss was to Restore Balance deck. And I played the Restore Balance deck, like, 
the second round I played. OG living in. OG living in. Heavy combo. No fulminators. I mean, I beat the Phoenix deck I played against pretty easy. This looks like Entomb Reanimate. Or Entomb. I don't know, maybe not. I just always assume the worst. That way you can beat the best hands. Not always the best way to go, but whenever you like assume that and they do nothing, you're like, wow, you had nothing? A whole bunch of it? Where'd you get all that nothing from? You went to to, to the nothing uh, discount store and got it for free ninety nine or what? You know? <laughs> it's always a good feeling. Okay, so it's looting, not uh, in tune. Not our worst fears realized. Probably just through the looting, or maybe they just sat on it to see if they would draw a creature. Chancellor, K. Okay. Dark Confidant's fighting the good fight. Oh, please exhume. That's another thing is what if they thought sees a hex mage, that opens them up to exhume. Uh, please exhume. I give you all the lunch money if you exhume right now. You think it's slow depths unlock? Uh, no. Or just trying it out. Just trying it out. I don't know. I I think it's 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 on the short list. If I had five decks, it, this would make it into the top five. So, and I'm not locked in on anything right now. So, we're just trying to figure it out. It's a solid deck. I'm liking. Uh, I want to play some Bomberman, and I want to play some uh, lands, and some slow depths. Might might try some standstill. I was too scared to play at the last one, but uh, you know I think it might be okay. Uh, maybe we'll, we'll have to see. Let's go ahead and wasteland this uh, Badlands. Then pass the turn. That's where they can't feed this looting flashback. Yeah, four go along too. That's pretty good, but there's a lot of True Name decks out right now, which kind of has me thinking that Four Color Loan is not that great, because True Name is so annoying, but Lomer Boy's tearing it up with it. I mean, he got some trophies, so. Brain Drain playing eight rounds or more. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot to that deck. I could live with that, though. Between you and me, I don't care, how's it going to be? <laughs> so we're not playing hate rounds, true that. Who's getting to unmask me? Joke's on you, I'm gonna tell him joke's on you, I got to. Joke's on you, buddy. Can't ignore, what's up, Lordcraft? Back in the Legacy Cube, man, you know what to do. That's pretty good. Y'all want a him or Bob? I like him. Yep. It's the good stuff, Lorecraft. It's a step towards living your best life for sure. Dark Depths and Dark Confidant. You don't know me anymore. Alright, tie ball game. 13 13.
Yep, okay, so we're gonna take four, so this is like a three turn clock if you assume that we're gonna flip some spell with Dark Confidant. Well, that was a spell. There's a good one. Let's get another Mox down. We'll go for the Hex Mage after we pitch this Dark Depths. And I want more mana sources just because there's a chance they're in play. So if the, we have to play two spells next turn, why we'll the mana to do it? I think it's probably more important than having a second depths. And I'm not going to make it on my main phase here. I'll make it on their turn. There's no super reason not to. I thought it definitely like that's play it easy. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Huh. You coming with that? Alright, I'm doing this. I don't really know what you're up to here, but I'm blocking. Lord, help me get away. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. We got a 2020 gang out here. Didn't want it. Didn't want it. All right, I think we're going to board similarly to last time. Surgical and him. And the needles and the Caracas. I think we can get rid of these abrupt decays, these safe keepers, and these scryings. I think we're going to keep the Dark Confidants and the Hex Mage so we try and be as fast as possible. Also, you know, Dark Confidant, as we saw in that first game, is really good against discard spells. I think I'll keep this. We're on the draw. We can get a turn one uh, needle if we draw an Urborg. That's great. If we draw a second Mox Diamond. This is a turn one 2020. Dex got the hand's got some uh, some 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 room to grow, and it's some uh, into a, a major heater. Major major heater growth potential. That's a mouthful. But that's what this hand's got. Also, we saw the last reanimator play show and tell. I don't even know if that's a thing that, that, that could happen. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's Grizzle Brand time. Yeah, to me, you can only draw seven. Can only draw seven. <laughs> it's hard out here. It's hard out here for a pimp, man. Can only draw seven. Uh, I don't know if I want to worry about the surgical. Why don't we just fetch it by you? I, I'm a little scared to pitch the Dark Depths in case of Surgical. Um, why not? Grizzle Brand. Let's go Grizzle, Grizzle Daddy. No more activating from you, buddy. I don't want to play this just so it doesn't get discarded. I'll pitch Dark Depths this time. We got Surgical. 
So be it. So be it. Surgical doesn't really seem like a card that's super effective against our deck. Except when we make it like in a situation like this. Yeah, well, we see show and tell. You've seen blue black reanimator in the past. Obviously, this is the black red version, but uh, with you know fetches and duels, we see it time and time again in Legacy. It's not that hard to play other colors. So sometimes you see uh, what's that card from Nemesis that they play sometimes? The two mana show and tell, show and tell. Um, Gambit, something Gambit. Stronghold Gambit. Strong Gold Gambit. That's it. Stronghold. Is it Stronghold or Strong Gold? Why are you so shy? So Crocs would be good. Any kind of man, uh, land search, crop rotation, because we boarded out the uh, seven uh, scrines. Maybe we can take out the seven library. Someone like you. It's kind of slow. And a bob too. Just keep the scrying. Oh, fuck it, me. Oh, my God. Is that a Ravager Worm? That's a Ravager Worm. That's scary. Ravage your worm, huh? I think we can't play Dark Death since they have Ravage your worm in the, in the graveyard. Dang. Wow. Ravage your worm made it a legacy, y'all. Welcome. Welcome, Ravage your worm. You, you've made it among the ranks of the best magic that can be played in the world. Can't make it a standard, but that's okay. There's a place for you in the legacy world. That's why legacy so sweet. I love the blue one if I did not. I couldn't stay away. I couldn't find it. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'll tweet that. Is it over? Yeah. face grizzle daddy let's go all right move with it I don't know move I don't think we want assassin stroke I really don't Jokes on you again. Jokes on you. Give it up. Right, let's try it again. Maybe uh, we want Assassin's Trophy. That's a whole way to go. Maybe we don't need Sajiri Step. Although, just being able to kill him in the 2020. He 
he's like, Deutsch, you must speak German. <laughs> nah. Nah. Tell him, nah, no thanks. What part of Germany are you from? <laughs> <coughs> what if we hit him with the, what part of Germany are you from? And they're like, what are you talking about? Frankfurt? And I'm like, no, 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 east or west? <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Too soon? Too soon, huh? Yeah. Can't hit him with that one. All right, we're going to run it back. Although, I, I think, we, no, we're going to cut the Southern Library in the loam. Those are slow things that we don't need. Give another 40 years? All right. All right, put it on a Google Calendar. Put it on a Google Calendar. 2060. Lowcrest says it's okay at 2060. This one's got a surgical, I gotta keep it. Nice. You got a chancellor this time? I'm looking, I'm watching. I'm watching you, Chancellor. When you reveal, make sure that I can see it, huh? That's the one thing I don't like about this. The one thing I don't like about uh, Chancellor Annex on uh, Magic Online. There it is. There's the old Chancellor, Daddy. Okay. Play it by you. Pass the turn. We can cast a surgical pay and two life and one mana. So hopefully they don't have a discard spell. Uh oh. Don't kill me. Is Dark Rit or Reanimate? Ooh, sorry. I gotta do this. Sorry, not sorry. Please be dead. You got two cards. Yes, I'll definitely pay the one. I like this surgical art. Once you see that it's coming from, from the head here, that's pretty cool. Make sure we get the one out of the graveyard. Let's check out what else they have in their deck. How many times have people not clicked the one in the graveyard? Unmasked. Tide Spout Tyrant. Ravager Worm. They got a trophy and an annex in hand. Exhum and Tomb. Chancellor. Trophy in the deck. Second trophy in the deck. Only one by you. Pretty sure they can't win. Pretty. T sure they can't win. We got them all. Okay, should have held surgical for Ravager. Yeah, left a little on the table there, but hopefully it won't draw into it, you know. And we'll rest their other spell, which I didn't take a picture of, but we know they have a chancellor in their hand, and there's a spell that we're supposed to duress. We can just go ahead and duress here. Get that trophy. And we don't want to Thought Seize the Chancellor. Because then it'll be easy for them to reanimate it. So we're just going to go ahead and play the Thespian stage. And pass the turn. We, like, no reason not to. Schultz, Cubed. I didn't announce it. Thanks for the Twitch Prime. Love 13 months, baby. Y'all make sure y'all check out Schultz Cube stream. You've been streaming, Schultz? I've been kind of out of the loop, but y'all drop him a follow. That's that's the lands aficionado right there. He he trained in the in the in the lone monastery, fighting off the uh, the miracle masters. Oh snap! That's a good one. All right. Yikes! <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> <coughs> mm -hmm. Big yikes. I was like, wow, he drew his eyes back. Couldn't have been a spell right there. 
I haven't been streaming, but I've been putting in some reps. This is my least favorite legacy meta since the banning. Yeah, pretty bad, huh? For lands, or are you just trying to play something else, or sometimes you got to move around a little bit. I think lands is probably okay though. Lands is kind of always just okay. It was like really good when we first met, but uh, times change, you know. Mm hmm. You don't say. Keep the stage at the ready. I think I'll sit rather stage before I hex an age. Still haven't wastelanded yet. Yay. Yay, 2020. What's going on here? What's up, Vans? What we're doing is we're using Desmond Stage to copy Dark Depths. So now we have a copy of Dark Depths with no counters on it, which causes this triggered ability that says... If it has no ice counters on it, sacrifice it. If you do, create a merit lage. Here you go. One of them. Get one of them. This is my this is my, my girlfriend right here, merit lage. That's my blue thing. Right there. Uh, if you're new to the stream of of me we're inseparable. Uh, but pretty much that's it. We're just making a twenty twenty and then you know, conveniently our opponent started at twenty life. So they're dead. What's going on with you, Vance? How you living, baby? Happy Monday. Got a case of the Mondays. We're here to cure them. Oh, uh, yeah. Then 39 SNS, DNT, ANT, and 7 Blue Red Delver. How is the Blue Red Delver match? That new Blue Red Delver deck that everybody's playing with the little, little Peter Mander. Huh? Little Peter Manor, uh, Delver deck. Is that match bad? They got a couple Blood Moons in the board I saw. No Wastelands. Didn't really see price progress. Looked like it wouldn't have been too bad. A lot of true names. Sure, I'll be able to play. Sure, I'll keep this hand. Let's get rid of the herb board with the hat. We want no hat herb board here. And then we'll go. I should have played that fetch lane again. I messed that up. Dark depths. So if we draw a crop rotation. No, not a crop rotation. I should have played the herb board or the, the stage. That way, if we drew a crop rotation. Not the stage. We should have played the. Uh, yikes. There's something we should have done better than what we did. I can't recall. This lane could have been something else, which would have been good. So the question is, do we want to just Dark Depths and then maybe uh, leave a Abrupt Decay? That guards us against him, the Torok, on our Dark Depths, which is nice. Or we could just play the stage. Probably should play the Urborg here and then cast the Sylvan Scrying. That way, if we did draw a crop rotation, we can crop rotate the Urborg after floating mana out of it and Dark Depths into a stage. That was what the play was. Um, if we we're going to play the Bayou, we should definitely play the Misty Rainforest. You're coming out here to Pittsburgh for the SCG event in a few months. I don't know the Lordcraft, maybe. I don't know what the format is. And I haven't looked at my schedule beyond April yet. So I'm just taking it a month at a time. Spreading around, working hard, living the dream. Hey, make the money, don't let the money make you, Vans. Yeah, we're playing some older Magic, some uh, Legacy. A lot of cool interactions with older cards. So if you're new to Magic, you know, uh, it's, 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 it's a sweet format. Because there's a lot of cool things that happen. Um, I think I'm actually going to just play the Dark Depths here. Because him and Torok could be a card that the opponent could be playing off of this Glitter Delta here. Uh, and I'd rather have the depths because we can we can trigger the depths uh, a couple different ways, either another stage or a hex mage. 
So and now we play the thespian stage. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm uh, hi, uh, Dylan. I'm uh, I'm actually queued for the Mythic Championship in London in a couple weeks, which is modern. Um, so I'll be playing some modern the following week. I'm doing the uh, legacy testing for Niagara, which is next weekend. Not this weekend, but next weekend. And then the following week, I'll test the modern leading up to the legacy, and then I'll play the modern slash limited the week after to get ready for London. So, two islands. This must be some kind of show and tell combo deck. But it's brainstorming, fetch landing. I think we just go ahead and make this thing. Say, you better have it, sucker. We'll see. Any thoughts on what you will be playing in modern? Yes. Uh, I want to play the Staring Bridge deck. Not sure which one. Uh, but I want to play one. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, go ahead. Plow me, daddy. Let's go. It's unfortunate. Thanks for the life. Thanks for the memories. Thanks for the memories. Uh-huh. So now we're going to lose. Uh, June 29th, I think. Probably, I'm not sure. I know I want to go to Bearded Dragon to play in the, the MCQ. Because that's a, a badass event. And... Uh, you know, I'm also sponsored by Bearded Dragon. If y'all want to know, if you're looking to buy Magic Singles, make sure you check out the Bearded Dragon link down below. You can type in Goon Squad at checkout, capital G, capital S, to get 10% off your online purchase. Best thing you can get on the internet right now. Blue Black Mill, definitely not a crazy. <laughs> I know you like that deck. I'm off it. I'm off it. Let's get another buy you. I guess we'll cast this. This Jay's gonna eat us alive with a card advantage that it produces. We got Force Will, Stoneforge Mystic. I think I'm just gonna concede now. Save some time. Six for uh, winners. Pittsburgh event. David Lawrence. What was the format? Do, do we know the format? Oh, Team Modern Open. Legacy Classic. Team Modern? If it's a team one, I'm probably going to play it. Okay. Um, we're up against Stone Blade. Maybe we want this for True Name. Maybe not. Probably want this for reasons. I don't know. For Source of Plowshare, right? They're not playing Edict, so I don't think we need the Dryad Arbor. Is Trophy better than Decay? Maybe not. We can do Needle on Jace. Not super exciting. Like Safekeeper into Dark Confidant's a big game. Um, and the Hem's okay too. I think we can cut one of these Abrupt Decays. Maybe we cut some of these Sylvan Scryings. We want to keep Sajiri Step as a way to protect their 2020. I don't think we need Bajuka Bog. That one can go. Keep the Wasteland Loan Package going. And I kind of like Liliana because it's an alternate win con that they have to deal with. But they do have Stone Forge, <coughs> which could make it difficult to uh, keep a Planeswalker in play. Hmm. This is a tough one. Tough one, tough one, tough one. What that create? Oh, mill? Oh, mill with bridge. <laughs> you do have bridges. There's bridges in that deck, ain't they? Oh, man. I don't know about this abrupt decay. I think they might have some kind of land hate. Maybe I'll just cut this. Be like, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hello. <laughs> I said, hey, what's up? Hello. Pretty and on the flow. So we're just missing a dark depths, but we get to turn one him to Torok, which is nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
few times I've been around that track. Uh, what am I going to do? Get a Bayou. And just start with turn one him. Hopefully we'll get both their lands. They did multi six. Plow. We got the plow. That's good. Hex Mage, play a Wasteland. Can't Tundra me, bro. And I think we're going to crop rotate the Wasteland into a Dark Depths. Uh, start with this. We'll take one of them. What if I waste this? What now? What now? Ooh, you ain't ready. We could have wasted it after. Might have been better, actually. Would have been better to waste it after because then we'd have to shuffle away the brainstorm, so we'd have a perfect information thought seize. Now they get a high to A card. But they're kind of just stuck with these six for the next couple turns. Surgical Disenchant Jace. Hmm. I think I'm going to take the Surgical. Just because we can kill a Jace with a Hex Mage. Might be high in a plow, that's possible. I hate to do a plow, so hold on one second. I need to take this plow. Oh. Hello. What is up? We already got one of the plows, so make them have the other one. I'm going to have to step away from the stream for just a second. We got to unmute. Unmute. Yep. Make them have the plow here. <sighs> make them have it. What you got? Looking for it. Chose the shuffle. Okay. Well, I'm making this thing. If you got it, you got it. That's the life I'm living. You dead! Ha ha! He <laughs> All that can tripping. And you ain't got nothing. What happened? What happened right there? I do not know. Mm hmm. I think we're going to keep everything the same. I'm not interested in doing nothing crazy. This all seems okay to me. And I'm going to AFK real quick. Put me on the be back list. I'll be right back.
Y'all can take me off the be back list now, because you know what? We back. All right, what we're going to do here. Wow, we back. <laughs> All right, we got multiple discard spells on Liliana. I'll rock with this. We got a full 16 minutes for this uh, game three. We, we conceded early game one. Let's see what they do with this ponder. Uh, burr. It's Burr up in here. Up in here. Up in here. Very Burr. Very much. Much Burr. Muy Fresca. Fresco? Fresca. I don't know. It's funny, you take like three years of Spanish and you don't remember this shit. <laughs> you don't use it, you lose it. Uh, you win, yeah. Yep, him with this thought sees. What do we do with this partner? Did not shuffle. Interesting. Okay, um, yeah, let's start with the thought sees. Fetch, get a bayou. Thought sees. So you taste swords back to basics? Hmm. Well, I don't have any way to remove this GTA. Supreme Verdict. So it's probably okay. Supreme Verdict can kill a Sylvan Safekeeper. Back to Basics is a magic card. They're going to get to keep this other card here. What creature are they going to get down that's like going to hoe us out with a GTA? Not many. Probably just want this Back to Basics. Seem fine to me. Start with this plus. Try and get this thing to ult. Get it started early. And then we'll come with the, the hem on the next one. Missing the third land drop. Hold up, hold up, hold up. This maybe we'll get the plow and we don't have to worry about it. Spell snare, huh? Alright. Don't you name me. Wait, is it even possible for them to damage? Because they spell snare, they drew past the turn. I wanted to draw both the cards. Oh, see you later, Lily. Council judgment. Alright, this is annoying. We need dark depths, quick. Because otherwise, we're just going to get Supreme Verdict. Which would suck. Employ this. I don't want him to supreme verdict me. Probably should have played the X Mage, but we can kill a Jace with the X Mage, which is cool. They want to 
fade to your huh? Copy this by you on the instep. <laughs> Kill the Jays. Got the marks in case coming back to basics. Four cards. It's not looking great for us. Attack first because they have another snap, they might not target the spell snare. Although, I guess they will. That's fine, we can hit him next turn. Same play. So they could have shuffled away one of these cards in their hand, but it's possible they have some. Bump up the mic volume. Test, 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 test. Better, better. I think that's better, huh? Is that more better? All right, Clary. What's up, baby? How you doing tonight? How you doing, Lagoon? We got, we got a bunch of legacy this week. You're not going to want to miss it. We're gonna play the bomber man. We're gonna play all kinds of stuff. We're gonna this this late hour. I thought you was a daytimer. I thought you was a daytimer. What happened? Tundra, make sure you can't encounter this. And I instinctually went to second main phase, so let's go ahead and him. Got two plows, alright, that's good. Two snaps, two plows, all that's dead. You keep drawing these brainstorms though. Let's go on to. Yeah, GTA is probably back in the deck. I'm gonna call rotation, okay. Working hard, baby. Can we get can we get a uh Yeah, they did hide the GTA. Mage, they can first strike the mystic to where they can't GTA us. Yep. Yep. And then you said, plow this thing. 
Okay. We got one in the graveyard already, so we're gaining two life. So we don't want to draw Dark Confidant anymore. We don't have any removal for this. I guess we'll get back to this fetch land instead of getting. Let's start uh, thinning our deck a little. Maybe we could try and dredge into a life from long into a dark depths. Let's get a buy you. I think I'm gonna dredge to try and hit the dark depths. Yep, there it is. Hopefully I don't have a surgical. Oh my god, you're the worst. I think he drew a surgical in that two turn window. It's beyond me. If we would have drawn, we would have just drawn a Thought Seize, which would have been good because we could have stopped the surgical from happening. But we didn't know that what we were going to draw. Oh, that's terrible. Might have could have played that better. Might have could have. I thought that was going to be a dub as soon as we had that Dark Depths. <laughs> and didn't have too much pressure on us. GTA 4 counters, that's 9 damage. Looking at maybe 9 and then 5 and then that's 13. We were above 13 so it was still like a 3 turn clock. Opponent drew so many plows, three plows. That third plow to be able to get that hex mage off the board to keep that stone stone forge going made it to where we had to play a little faster to try and find the 2020. Third plow is perfect. Mmm, sure. Bottom balls of six. Yep. I don't know about that old sneaky show deck. I know you got a lot of experience with Clarion, but it's just not me. Snow covered planes. I don't know what that means. Give me a buy you. The rest here. Let's see if we get a plow out of them. Get two plows and a wasteland and a walking ballista. Okay. You gonna waste me? That would be a shame. Stone Forge, huh? Don't you get better skull? Yep. Get another bayou. Let's get another bumpy kid. This. Got another plot on their hand. Okay. Wasteland in the factory. All right. I think I'm gonna get this long off. Oh, we can't be interrupted by a wasteland or nothing like that. If I were them, I probably would just play the blist on one. If 
you're ever going to make it a four mana anyway. Alright, we know the hand. You going to play this Bliss now or what? Uh, that's more better. Start with this. Pay. Go get a forest. Or another bayou, I guess. Probably should just carpet this bayou and put the stage. That would that would be way better. That was a mistake. Play this. Chill. is gone. Hopefully I don't drop the rockets. Don't drop the rockets. Alright, plow's gone. <laughs> what else you got? A port. Seems important. Play this by you out. Are we gonna fetch for a forest? I'm gonna do that. Then this deck a little bit. Get two dark depths. Alright. Who's that? Hashtag Honda. Hashtag Honda with the Switch Prime love. Three months in a row. What's up, baby? Thanks for continuing to support the Goon Squad. Appreciate you. What happened? Happens to Candle Post deck. Just not good in the meta now. Yeah, I don't think it's great. Oh my god, it's Palace Jailer. That's the worst. Alright, not the worst, but pretty bad. So you can copy this port, I guess. Drawing two cards a turn. Here comes Batter Skull. Steps can be late. Yeah, I haven't played it in a while. I don't I think the deck's got like pretty high fail rate. It's got some huge upside, but it's also got some some pretty bad the fail rate's pretty high. Probably should have waited. You can say Caracas or a second palace trailer. You're gonna tap the ancient tomb. Fuck. 
What does this get? We do have a crop rotation. We got land. I guess we'll still back the monarch, which is good. Batter skills in play, so flick wispin and mystery. You name Vampire X Mage, buddy. Yeah, I'll definitely draw another card. Thank you. Aw, uh, of course it's real box time while they got the revoker in play on it. Let me checks out. Come at me, bro. We got crop rotation to go get Sajiri step to counter the flick wisp. Kill here. They're at two. Okay. What are you going to do? Try and set up a Mother Runes Flick Voice, but it looks like... Step this, give it pro white. You're dead. Dead. D E D. Get him out. So Jerry Step got a kill, that's cool. What we want. We definitely want these Lilianas. Marsh casually seems good. Maybe Needle. We can stop Caracas. Hmm. What cards do we not want? Bajuga Bog. See that one? Going out. Car rotation seems fun. Seven Lowry is probably not great. A lot of interaction here. I like Dark Confidant. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't know if we want him or thoughts. He's we're on the draw, so like a turn two die, he's gonna make casting him pretty difficult. <clears throat> That's true. Library is good against swords. Maybe we just don't need these scryings.
from opponent's thought sees. 26 lands here. Hmm. I don't know, we want this trophy also. This can destroy a land, which is tight. I'd be worried about like a turn one mom messing us up. Maybe we just don't want the ham on the draw. It does mess with their hand a little bit though. Dried Arbor was also a possibility. Yeah, Dark BK top aided. Daily G, congrats, baby. What's up? Mm. Let me keep this. Oh, we need another mana producing land. I think that's okay. Because we got a needle. Perfect. Turn that vial off. No free shit, bro. We ain't having that out here. A wasteland could be annoying. You want to have them? Probably just play the Sylvan. Wait a seven off of a bayou. That might have been better actually. Then let them decide they want to wasteland. It's kind of hard to wasteland when we have a needle out on their either ball. Dilly G figured out how to break the modern format, y'all. So I'm very happy to have him in the Goon Squad chat tonight. <laughs> Had the disenchant, okay. I don't know. You got Thalia with it or a oh, rip? It's a little company. Oh, uh, why did I do that? Why didn't I replicate this? We're never going to be able to replicate this later. It's going to be the issue. Like, we get the two for one now. We're not going to be able to get the two for one later. Oh, there's a chance that we might, might not be able to cast him with Torok. That was a mistake. Lunar cast Ascension. Money don't grow on trees. Alright, so we're going to have them after this. We have them again. Let's 
Let's see if it don't waste me. Yep. Hey, we got mouse to feed. It's where the chuckle was at. Why does he have ripping against you? That's a good question, Doji. It's a good question because people like because I have life from alone game one. I only play one. We'll probably draw it just to make that rip look right. We dark confidant or something, huh? Planes of snow covered planes. The old mix arena. Drawing like trash over here. Where's my Liliana at? Pretty good, Cheeky. How you doing, baby? Fans. Tackle one of them. Then we can block we we'll block the revoker with the other one. If they want to blow a a uh, plow on my blocker, I can live with that. Alright. One for one slap, some with it. I got four drops in hand. They flick with the needle, they go ball in a uh, palace jailer. Take one. Yep, it's gonna happen. Then we're gonna need to draw a removal spell so we can. I know he's just gonna chain out some uh, one toughness creatures. Yep. Probably gonna get another Flick of Wisp. Need to find a legacy deck I like. Is there an animator any good? Uh, cheeky. Yeah, it's strong, it's powerful. I'd rather have a ham sandwich. <laughs> that clip was so good. Not any marsh casualties. Three go to nine. And we got a block now. We probably should have blocked that other thing earlier. Hmm. 
and got no maze in his deck. No, stage, stage isn't really going to get it. I mean, now it's it's March Casualties is what we need. We could get a stage now and just go and copy this Wasteland. Wouldn't be too bad. Parenter G, what's up? Thanks for the resub, baby. That's tier three love. Look at you. We got we got some new new emotes in here. You can do the whole siege gang, man. When we got the whole siege gang out there, you get the siege gang with the goon heads. <laughs> I, I think I got one of your lists in the queue. I don't think I played it yet. Let's see. Yeah, I got it in the queue. 25 doubloons on the bump. That bug mid-range deck. If you wanted to change that, just let me know. Can't even count on myself. I think we got to do this to thin, thin our deck, to be honest with you. Just to thin. Copy the wasteland. <laughs> Dead anyway, so we might as well look and see what's going on. Bad eggs though. Alright. Oh man, I appreciate you. I appreciate you, baby. Thanks for keeping this ship uh, sailing. Multiple rips, huh? I don't know. I don't get it. Huh? Come with this trophy. The Torox seemed pretty good right there. Maybe we just cut the Dotsies. Let me just take out the loan. Probably. Since they do have the uh, graveyard hate. Let's take the loan out. Hex Mage is kind of dope because it's two power first strike. Maybe we want that. Instead of this trophy. I, I could get behind that. Two power first strikes to open the world X ones. <clears throat> True. Yeah, in a pinch, Lordcraft. Like if we really worried about like a vial on three for Flicker Wisp blowing us out, we could take the vial counters off, force their hand. Good point. Be okay. I think we're trying to beat them with overall cards number of cards so like uh, we need to see Dark Confidant keep it this hand and then we'll fetch me a Bayou Guess I was wrong. I just don't belong. Dead. I've been there before. It's alright. 
Just say goodnight and I'll show my... Son. We might have one of them plays here. To cause a big scene. Trying to guard him if we get hit at him. That'll mess our hand up a little bit. <coughs> Got Marsh Casualties. Chases my blues away. Play another Bob and Chill. Gotta watch out for a Vol and Stoneforge. Well, it's gonna be hard to kill them when they when we got Sylvan Safekeeper out there. And they can Vol and Revoke or maybe Plow one. I can see that. Did you happen to catch the Sneak Fit list? No. <laughs> <laughs> what is this list, Clarion? Is it in Discord? Put it in the chat. Take a look at it. I'm not big on social graces. Think I slip on down to the oasis. Oh, I got friends. No places. <coughs> Probably Revoker. <coughs> I'd like to see an herb board here. Last time is fine. Okay. Maybe I'll play this Mox Diamond. <coughs> Maybe I'll ball and revoke her in response. Let's see if he vials in that revoker. If so, we'll destroy the vial, maybe. The left of his stage, though. That was a mistake. It's poor form. Before I went up to three, actually, I should have broke the kid right here, but I'm a little worried about a uh, GTA equipped. word oh that was so bad that's the worst that's the stone worst that's the stone worst what was I doing why didn't I broke the case something 
Why didn't I broke key this one up? Keep. I was really worried about a GTA. We got, we got like next to nothing here. First strikers out here, I guess. Let me get a Liliana. Can't play any these twos. That's so bad. If I had a brokeated either while and then casualties on my turn, that would have been game. I just was not thinking about that. I was not thinking about saying the pre lead off of that while. Alright, let me check it out. Let's see what's going on in Discord. Also, if y'all want to keep the conversation going outside of the stream, make sure you check out the Discord. Just follow the link. We got another Athalia, I guess. Titan Storm Breath Dragon? What? It's a wild looking list right there. What's up, Bubbles? Thanks for that tier 2 sub. Don't forget about your Siege Gang emote. We got the Siege Gang going. We can't plow anymore. Can't rest in peace. Kind of not the worst. Alright. We got the dark depths now. They can flick with though. That's kind of scary. I guess we had an attack for two there, but we'd rather have the blocker back. So our bobs don't get run over. Should be a flick of wisp. Got anything to remove this vial? Nothing for three. I'm just gonna go for it because if they want, they can't. They can only really attack with the Revoker because the Prelates are gonna be uh, held back by the Dark Confidants because they don't want to lose the Prelates. All right, Rope K can't cast. Is an Arab war. Like Flick, Flick was getting us. Yep. Now they get an attack with this. Can swords now. I will block the revoker, I think. Holy smokes. I think I'm doing all this. Bows are gonna go. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot to remove count off this dark depths. A mistake. Alright, so now we're cleaning that up. I don't know why you take this really for two. Sure. It's dope. Get two counters off the dark depths this time. Johnny Bressett with the raid. Thanks, Johnny. Y'all make sure y'all check out Johnny Bressett's stream. Drop him a follow. Back on the grind, yep. We out here. I think I want to name Wasteland here, believe it or not. Now, I'm not going to propagate this. I'm going to wait. Not even bored, though. So I don't think they realize that the Urborg makes the agents going to be able to tap for black, which isn't painful. I'm going to play a League of Sneak and Show ever by chance. Johnny Bressett, I might do that. I actually, you know what? You sent me a raid. Why don't you just do a submit? Submit your deck list. I'm going to put it in the queue since you raided me, and I'll jump it off with 10 the balloons, huh? How about that? And then we're going to be forced to play it. And we'll play it on, uh, it'll be uploaded to YouTube as well. All the new people from Johnny Bressett's stream, if you don't know me, I'm your host, Jody Magic Fest Keith. Uh, Legacy Lands Master. I play a lot of Legacy. Uh, I recently won a standard Grand Prix, so I guess I'm a standard player too. <laughs> and uh, all around, I do deck submissions. You can check out uh, the queue down below if you want to submit a deck. All subs, Patreons, and uh, uh, VIPs can submit their deck list. Or if you want to just donate to, to get the balloons for your deck, every day your deck is in the queue. It gets one to balloon, one dollar is one to balloon. Also, if you want to check out the Patreon, I got the link right there in the chat. That's another way you could get your deck submissions in with the balloons. And, uh, yeah, so, you know, I play all the decks and then I upload them to YouTube. Make sure you check out my YouTube in case you're missing my live content. Okay, if they're passing, I think I might just abrupt decay the vial. And then remove one counter. So now we're going to take for one. Oh boy, what a grind. Ooh, Caracas. We can't waste that thing either. Shit. We already use our marsh casualties. We're dead on this thing. We're dead, what, this turn? Forgot to remove the second counter. Okay, what can we do with this? Damn it, of course we draw a crop rotation this turn. That mirror crusader's got us dead. That's one thing we don't have a maze. I like playing a maze in the sideboard of this deck sometimes. Like a maze would be great right here. To buy us one turn anyway. Uh I don't think there's anything we can do here. We're just a turn late. We're turning late on this crop rotation. If we were drawing a turn earlier, they'd be dying in this 2020. Mm. Also, we forgot to remove two counters off this Dark Depths. One, two, three. I don't think there's, there's no land that we could... Even if we had Dried Arbor in a deck that's green. No, there's no step plays. Nice, Johnny Bressett, nice. I'm going to add it to the queue after the stream. 
And if anybody else wants to submit a deck list, that's cool too. No Cabal Pit, but that would be turned off from Rest in Peace as well. Bubbles. But that's a card you can consider possibly playing. Cabal Pit, especially if you play a multiple loam list. Yeah, it looks like we're just dead. Rip. Rip easy. Oh, it's sad. Kills our 3-2 dream. Yep. The whole 1-3. Alright, I think I'm off this deck, y'all. I think we're off it. Uh, yeah, this is a screen grab from my tweet. Make sure you check out my, my tweeters. Legacy Steve already in Fountain, huh? We went back to control. Kind of control. We're going to play next. Let's see what's in the queue. Let's see what's in the queue over here. Let's say bye to the YouTubers first. YouTube, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Like to know what you think about this deck. What are some cards you like to see in this deck list? Uh, maybe to help improve it. I think, uh, you know, all the cards serve a purpose. Uh, the Dried Arbor makes for some plays against Diabolic Edict and whatnot. But, you know, the cards are kind of situational. We never saw Liliana last hope. That card would have been great in the match. We also have this Marsh Casualties. Uh, Dread of Night would have been all right. Um, that's a card that I've played in multiples in the sideboard of this deck for that one match in particular. So, I don't think you need four safe keepers. That's a lot of safe keepers. You could probably cut one and put a Dread of Night in here. Maybe get a second Dread of Night. I like having like three hate cards for that match because they can interact with you on so many different levels. But again, if you like the content and want to see more of it, make sure you hit the thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe. And if you want to support the content, the best way to do so is through one-time PayPal donations. Join my Patreon for the sweet perks or getting your Goon Squad gear so you can represent the next live event. All links down below. One love, good vibes. Catch you later, YouTube.